Habai Frabin, Aban Rabbi Aban, Aban Yabu Abu Kabe. Hi, friends, I'm Leon. Are you okay? I was on Zoom and the third cast with Bernadette and Louise. And ever since that time, even when I was on Zoom, I played drums. So since that time, I have been performing, recording, and traveling all over the world with many different musical artists. Let me name just a few, like Michael Jackson, Stevie Wonder, Mick Jagger, Madonna, Damian Marley, Nas, just to name a few, just to name a few. So today, I'd like to share with you an activity that you can do at home with your family during this time period when we are on lockdown. We are not supposed to leave our home, so we have some activities to keep us busy and share with each other. So today, I want to share with you this drum here that I've made, and it's called a cuica. This is a drum from Brazil. It has a chopstick inside, so what we're going to need is a plastic tube, some tape, and chopsticks, and a cutting utensil, and a piece of material that we will rub up and down on the stick. And that is how we get the sound quicker. The drum, when you play it, makes the sound of its name. You take the cloth, and we're going to apply a little water on it. And then we take that, put it in between our hands, and we stick our hand inside the drum and wrap it around the chopstick. And we slide up and down and we get a play the guica. So now I'm going to show you how to assemble it. So we get our tube that we take and we're going to strike on the bottom and make a indentation here and across this way. Now I have already done it so it'll be easy and quick for us to show you. Then you take the chopstick and you stick it down inside the hole. Now, we take our tape and we apply the tape on the stick to hold it down on top of the drum. And we tape it around the stick and to the top of our cylinder here. And we do that a couple of times. And you make sure that you apply it to the top of the round part here on the drum. And we do it four times, so I'm going to cut two more pieces. And once again, put it on the stick and onto our surface on the stick and onto the surface because we need it to stay in place. Then we'll take big pieces of tape and tape down those pieces to hold them down into place. And I use a Zacto cut on this one. This is a lot of fun. You can take time doing it and designing your drum and coloring it and painting it, whatever you want to do with it to make your design on your drum. And I'm doing it kind of quickly so it won't be as neat. And last piece across the top to hold down those pieces that we put on the stick. Then, we take a piece of material, 
and I have a nail that we use, and you just take a nail and poke it through a hole into the material, because now we're going to take a piece of string, and that goes into the hole that I just made, and you tie a knot so that the string will stay attached to the cloth. Then you put a knot in the other end of the stick, uh, string. <laughs> and then we take that piece down at the bottom of the drum. And I, used, I like to make it so that the knot is uh, above the tape so that it doesn't come out when you move it up and down on the stick inside the drum. And there we have our weaker. Now, once again, we have to apply water to it. And the friction of the sliding up and down on the stick is what creates our sound, the weaker.